and um, thank you so much for being here and uh, how are you feeling i'm feeling good hello very good good you know we'll be a handful of people but then let's make this very special it's a historic occasion and uh, let's make this happen because we at the end the consumers must be smiling saying yeah hamari life mein is something which became very easy simple those benefits which we were looking for here it is we're looking forward for that all right um we as people we all love stories don't we is every everybody you know you all are in the to the business of speaking and uh, you all are great storytellers right right we like listening to stories we like telling stories now i've got something for you guys all right so what is this is i'm going to come to each table i'm going to start a story i'm going to stop somewhere and from there the person who i am with picks it up builds the story maybe somewhere integrate the new indian oil access bank credit card if you can and let's make it interesting all right the table which creates the best story gets a big prize sounds interesting the <laughs> what the prize is is the surprise all right and so once once the launch is done believe me it's going to be good all right so what we lose before we get started i know it's uh, everybody had lunch just a very important question how many of you had lunch good me has sir post lunch is the most taxing session suddenly you know it becomes very all right so what we do is uh, we all are one big family because three giants coming together and we're going to create history so what we do is just a little ice breaker to get started i want you to give me a little rhythm it goes like this and sing along ek dusre se karte hain pyar hum एक दूसरे के लिए बेकरार हम एक दूसरे से करते हैं प्यार हम एक दूसरे के लिए बेकरार हम एक दूसरे के वास्ते मरना पड़े तो सडनली बोलना पड़ा और राइट एक दूस कमाल लेट्स डू दिस वन मोर टाइम और राइट सडनली सेइंग यार ये हमें नहीं पता थे हमें गाना भी है एक दूसरे के वास्ते मरना पड़े तो है तैयार हम ऑल राइट नाउ वी गेट स्टार्टेड विद द स्टोरी ओके द स्टोरी इज वेरी सिंपल विच टेबल डू आई गेट स्टार्टेड विद वी गॉट अ लॉर्ड ऑफ लीडर्स अराउंड यू नीड टू गो देर ऑल राइट ओके द लेडी सेइंग द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पीपल राइट देर दैट वन ओके सर कैन आई स्टार्ट फ्रॉम दिस टेबल इज इट ओके ऑल राइट वेरी सिंपल लेट स्टार्ट ऑफ यूर hot sunny morning i take the flight i was thinking about this holiday for a long time in goa finally reached my destination exotic resort and i take some rest in the morning i see out of the window and caught hold of my access bank card <laughs> using my internal brand name climb to the axis of the float tower at the top and saw the visual in the front the sea and when i was seeing the sea that was a very nice one you just got to the point directly you know <laughs> all right i see the sea and there on the sea there were girls there were guys there were elders there were kids they were running around and then at that corner i saw a nice outlet they were selling yeah we were and the nice outlet was having fueling so at, then uh, i also started going to that uh, uh, beach side and started enjoying with others hmm. when i was enjoying i suddenly looked at a person who was coming to me do aankhe do haath do pair mere paas badhte hue aur wo उसके पास एक मोटरसाइकिल भी थी और वो मोटरसाइकिल हाई एंड थी उस पर मेरे को बैठने का मन किया लेकिन उसके पास तेल नहीं थी देन <laughs> उसने मुझसे पूछा कि हाउ टू गेट द फ्यूअल आई सेड गेट इंडियन ऑयल एक्सिस ब्रांड रुपए पे कार्ड यू कैन गेट द फ्यूअल फिर मैंने वो कार्ड लिया फिर मैं बाइक पे बैठा 
मैं जा रहा था और और मैं उम्मीद कर रहा था कि कुछ ना कुछ इंसेंटिव इस पे मिलेगा <laughs> कुछ कैश बैक मिलेगा कुछ पॉइंट्स मिलेंगे रिडीम करूंगा डबल फायदा होगा दैट वॉज माई पॉइंट फायदा तो इतना सारा हुआ लेकिन ये फायदा मुझे बहुत पसंद आया कि खूबसूरत से एक लड़की सामने से गुजर रही थी <laughs> और उन्हें बताया कि मेरे पास एक्सिस कार्ड है तो अगर मुझे लिफ्ट दोगे तो मैं आपको फेरिंग भी दे दूंगा जोर रहता है इट्स यू माइंड विच कैन गो जस्ट एनी वेयर राइट यू नो आई थॉट समेर यू गोन इंटीग्रेट द कार्ड बट इट वॉज सो ब्यूटिफुली डन थैंक यू सो मच लेट्स गिवान प्लॉस कम एवरी बारी ओ राइट ओके एंड वी गेट स्टार्टेड मैंने रेडियो ऑन किया गाना चल रहा था मैं तो रस्ते से जा रहा था मैं तो भेल पूरी खा रहा उसके बाद देन आई रियलाइज दैट भेलपुरी वाला जो है इज क्वाइट अ गॉजियस मैन सो आई गो टू भेलपुरी बट वेन आई रीच टू द भेलपुरी वाला बिहाइंड दैट देर इज दिस पेट्रोल पम्प ऑफ आई ओ सी एल एंड आई रियलाइज दैट यू नो इन द इवनिंग मे बी आई कैन गो फॉर अ स्ट्रोल एंड देर फॉर लेट मी जस्ट यूज दिस कार्ड ऑफ माइंड विच हैज लाइक अमेजिंग बेनिफिट एंड देन प्रॉब्लम आई कैन आस्क यू आउट फॉर अ कॉफी एंड टेक यू आउट फॉर अ राइड भेलपुरी वाला स्माइलिंग वो इतना खुश हुआ कि उसने अपने दोस्त को इंट्रोड्यूस किया जो बहुत मतलबी था वो इतना मतलबी था उसने बोला कि इसके बेनिफिट्स इतने सारे हैं और उसने मेरा कार्ड चुपके से ले लिया एंड उसके बाद और वो आ, अपने दोस्त के पास गया और आ, अपना कार रिफ्यूल किया विद द एक्सिस बैंक कभी कभी होता है दैट्स ऑल राइट और उसने कार्ड लिया और उसने उसी समय उसका ड्रीम ब्रेक हो गया ही रियलाइज इट्स रेडियो सॉन्ग दैट इज लिसनिंग टू एंड इज नॉट एक्चुअली एट अ बीच हैविंग भेलपुरी एंड ही वॉज थैंकफुल दैट इज कार्ड इज सिक्योर सेफ्टी फर्स्ट सेफ्टी लेट्स गिव अग राउंड प्लस कम ऑन एवरी बारी वेरी नाइस ओके हाउ आर यू डूइंग सर फाइन फाइन गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग सर आपके लिए स्टोरी यहां से शुरू होती है थक 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 आईपीएल की मैच चल रही है आखिरी ओवर एंड हार्दिक पांड्या है छह रन दो बॉल मेरी आंखें उस पर उसकी आंखें बॉल पर बॉलर की आंखें आप पर और तो मैं सोच रहा हूं यार अगर बॉलर की जगह मैं होता फिर मैंने सोचते सोचते ये सोचा कि मैं तो फील्ड पे नहीं हूं लेट मी एंजॉय द थिंग व्हाट आई एम डूइंग आई एम एंजॉइंग द मैच सो लेट हैव ए ग्लास ऑफ बियर बट हाउ टू पे आई हैव माय एक्सिस बैंक को ब्रांडेड कार्ड लिंक्ड इन माय पेमेंट ऐप सो लेट्स गो फॉर इट एंड पे एंड गेट सम इंसेंटिव आउट ऑफ इट रिवॉर्ड्स एंड ऑल दैट इज हाउ आई एम डूइंग तालियां तो आई थॉट आई एम गोन पे इट थ्रू दैट उसके बाद मैंने सोचा कि यार मैं पे करूं फिर मैंने सोचा भाई ये पे करने का इरादा तो है ना तो मोबाइल मेरे पास है वॉलेट मेरी वाइफ लेके चली गई और उसके बाद सिचुएशन बहुत गंभीर उसके बाद मेरी नींद खुली एंड मैंने रियलाइज किया कि मैं अभी भी उसी बीच पर हूं और मैंने सोचा कि क्यों ना इस इस सिटी के सारे बीच एक्सप्लोर करूं और फिर मैं मनी मन गा रहा था बाबू समझो इशारे हॉर्न पुकारे पम 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 फिर मैंने रियलाइज किया कि गाड़ी में थोड़ा ऑयल कम है फ्यूल कम है तो जो सबसे नजदीक मुझे फ्यूल स्टेशन दिख रहा था इट वाज इंडियन ऑयल पेट्रोल पंप और मैंने अपना वॉलेट देखा आई हैड एक्सिस बैंक रुपे कार्ड टैंक फुल कराया और पूरा शहर सारे बीचेस घूम के आया लेडीज एंड जनरल लेट्स गिव अग राउंड इज जस्ट टू ब्रेक दिया एब्सोल्यूटली फैंटासिक थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू सो मच सर आपकी कहानी को इन्होंने जो काया पलट की वो तो बिल्कुल परफेक्ट था एक बार जोरदार तालियां यू नो इट इज इट इज अ वेरी हिस्टोरिक ओकेजन इट इज द टाइम वेर वी विल यू नो थ्री बिग जॉइंट कमिंग एंड मेकिंग लाइफ इजी फॉर ऑल ऑफ आज नो वी वी लिव इन द डिजिटल एज जहां पर कन्वीनियंस इज सो इंपॉर्टेंट एंड दैट्स प्राइम मैरिली वाई दिस इज सो इंपॉर्टेंट वेर वीव गॉट द इंडियन ऑयल एक्सिस बैंक रूपे क्रेडिट कार्ड विच इज गेक आर लाइफ 
बेटर वीव गॉट समथिंग मोर अब इसमें जब हमने इतनी सारी चीजें ये कर ली तो वी वॉन्ट नो मोर अबाउट दिस सो इसीलिए वीव गॉट दिस वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग पैनल डिस्कशन एंड वेरी जर्मन लेट्स हियर इट फ्रॉम आर एस्टीम्ड dignitaries who have played a critical role in curating this proposition uh, for the con- consumers like you and me i'm really looking forward for this not because i'm hosting this but um, i saw the features and i saw i just heard about this did a little study and uh, believe you me i'm very excited about this ladies and gentlemen the future of digital payments was seen first with the birth of the credit card which was one of the earliest mode of cashless transactions and it has revolutionized the way we transact for ever and today uh we poised to grow at a cagr of 39.22% during the financial year 2022 to 2027 period uh this session is very very important we're going to discuss uh, the future of cashless uh, payments and how the credit card segments are poised to grow so let's go on and let me introduce uh, our panel a very interesting panel ladies and gentlemen i want you to give a big round of applause as uh, i welcome them but before that uh, npci has been at the forefront of digital and contactless payment revolution in the country and uh, let's throw some light on this and for that i'd invite miss pravina rai ceo npci to take the stage passionate about payments and technology as drivers to economic value miss rai helps npci attain its strategic objective of offering simple secure and seamless digital payments experience to consumers and users acro- across the ecosystem that can lead to rapid digitalization of india ladies and gentlemen please give a big round of applause our first panelist ms praveena rai all right ladies and gentlemen our next panelist is uh, shri sandeep makar um, executive director retail transformation at indian oil um uh shri sandeep magar sahab has over three decades of rich experience in marketing of petroleum products uh especially in retail sales technology expertise um, ranges from field of engineering retail sales automation fleet marketing operations business development mergers and acquisition and setting up technology platforms let's give him a big round of applause so welcome sir and uh joining us on the stage as a third panelist is mr sanjeev moge president and head of cards and payments from axis bank uh, he has more than two decades of experience in the cards and payments domain spanning across products sales strategy and management let's give him a big round of applause welcome sir All right ladies and gentlemen um, there's no secret that Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee credit card will open new opportunities uh, for the digitally prosperous India uh, I've got a question before the actual panel uh, gets started I you know I've been thinking about this uh, Ms Praveena Rai uh, this question is for you ma'am um, you've been a part of the IPL I'm, I'm a big how many of you are IPL fans very nice Ma'am, um, uh, you all have um, done so well. Uh, Rupees growing, and so are digital payments in India. Uh, very important question is in the next IPL. Can I get a seat next to MS Dhoni or a photo with him? The digital fan is very uh, popular. Yeah, uh, ma'am, pure season ke pure. My next question is coming to that the rupee access card yes ma'am um, i was coming to that and uh, for that uh, mr sanjeev moge for the first few matches uh, booking window yeah. uh Man has been kind that you know. She, uh, one sec, I'm just gonna. Uh, I think we just need to switch it on. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Uh, you can answer the question because I heard it. You all, did you all hear it? Yeah. So, ma'am has been kind. Thank you so much, ma'am. Uh, I get a booking window, but can I get a window to sit next to Miss Thoni, ma'am? Uh, we'll have to work it out. We have eight months. We'll figure something. There's nothing that we. Can You're kind-hearted, ma'am. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> you know. All right, Mr. Sanjeev Moge. Uh, the next question is to you, and uh, this is a very simple one. Um, you know, Axis Bank is one of the largest private sector banks in India, and uh, does that mean I get a free credit card after the event? 
not free, but uh, you will get a card where you pay 500 and you actually get 50 liters of fuel free. In 50 the, liters of fuel free? So basically you pay 500, you get almost, multiply 50 liters with 100 rupees, 110 rupees, you almost get value back. For wow! Can I get two? Sorry? Uh, two cards. <laughs> Dil to bacha hai ji, you know, just dil mangi more so. Yeah. Thank you very much. That's a very nice uh, thing. And um, well, the third one is, um, boy, I, you know, this is something which I wanted, sir, uh, for every partnered product that the customer buys, the bond of ecosystem becomes stronger. And sir, this is for you. And you know, sir, petrol is a manga, sir. sir. Sir, after the event, because I'm doing this very important event, everybody's been looking for this event, sir. Is event ke baad agar main car leke jau and I can show the picture, my picture with you, sir. Can I get a tank full, sir? Kiske saath picture aapki? Sir, aapke saath, sir. Petrol, main alag alag main na ek ka main picture ma'am ke saath le raha hu, ek aapke saath, ek aapke saath, sir. Fuel free mil jayega, na? Please, sir, dekho na, sir. I am a little bit of a child, sir. I am a little bit of a child, sir. But, uh, but thank you so much. Let's give a big round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, I have to tell you this. These were just the fun questions, but then, you know, we, we, we got something which is, and honestly, with all, all, all uh, my heart, I have to tell you, I was really looking forward for this. The Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee Credit Card, which is going to make life easy for all of us. And we've got some really important questions. And for that, we've got the moderator of this session who's who's going to set the context and who's brilliant ladies and gentlemen please give a big round of applause for kunal kalawatiya chief of products of for npci and he's going to be here and he's going to do that come on let's give him a big round of applause thank you kunal thanks iki thanks iki i think you've asked all the questions on this list at least <laughs> so i think thanks for making it fun and light uh, this is on behalf of everyone, so this is uh, this is not from me. There's some personal questions, some tough ones, uh, but we would need an answer, right, for all of them. So, uh, starting with you, Sanjeev. Uh, I think uh, when you look at the industry right now, the closure of March, I think it's like a crazy history that we've already created. 73 million cards, 11 million cards issued in the last year itself, rupee trillion spends. So I think there are more challenges and more opportunities ahead of the industry. What's your sense of what are the drivers of the last 24 months of the industry? And when you look forward 24 months, what do you think are the drivers going to be? And you're talking about cards? You're talking about overall Cards. Rate? Okay, cards. See, actually it's been quite fascinating because two, three things happened, right? Uh, one is we went through, and it's just as recent as two years back, uh, the first wave of COVID. April, May, June of 2020 I'm talking about. Nobody knew what's going to come next. Uh, many people lost their jobs. Some people had complete freeze of business cycle. And of course, all of us were at home for like 40, 50 days, scared to step out. Uh, so that was the phase where it started. And I'm really talking about April of 2020. From there onwards, we realized, ki, okay, waves will come, waves will go. We obviously need to take our precaution, wear masks, get vaccinated. Vaccine came in. It looked like it's going to take 23, 24. We've actually all in the room must be double vaccinated. Many of us must be. Uh, have, must have got the booster dose as well. In terms of payments, what it did was two, three things. One is uh, Morat came in. So people took moratorium, people who were facing economic squeeze. They came out of it. Uh, NPS went up, which was a 2020 phenomenon. 21 onwards, as people started stepping out, payments, uh, the growth rate came back. Before that, if you were to look at cards industry, credit card industry I'll talk about, was growing roughly at 30 percentage year on year. Uh, the year of FI21 was a squeeze, but you take FI21 out, 22 on 21 was a very good growth, I think 35-40 percentage plus. Uh, access within that was growing faster than the industry. Again, if you right now were to look at FI23 early trends, last couple of months, it's again growing pretty well. Second thing, customer acquisition is back. The numbers you were talking about, 11 uh, lakhs for us, 1.1 million was just one quarter of quarter four. And obviously the trajectory continues, not only for us. So for other banks as well. So that clearly means credit card base will increase. Why is credit card important? Again, we have gathered today for the launch of Indian Oil City Bank, uh, sorry, Indian Oil Access Bank Rupee Card. I think one important aspect is credit card is important because a normal ticket size and the wallet size increases. If I have credit in my wallet, I don't have to take out that 500 rupee cash, 100,000 rupee cash. I can spend, and I know there is a value back. Value back can be 50 days of credit free. 
period, value back can be I get reward points. Incidentally, on fuel, I get 4 percentage reward points on Indian oil card. So on and so forth, which means I spend more on that card. Which is why credit is always an important instrument, not only in terms of loans, but actually in terms of credit card. So that is the second trend. Third, on the merchant side, again, we are seeing expansion of devices, stroke terminals. A lot of it is on the UPI side, but even on cart side, a lot of more merchants, deeper geographies of India are now taking terminals. Which basically means this trend is going to continue. If more people are taking credit card, people who have are spending more because the economy is open, sentiment is good. And third, there are merchants who are now accepting cards who were not accepting cards earlier. That means the trajectory is going to remain healthy as we carry on. So that's what I see playing out over the next two years as well. Sure, that, yeah. That's great. I think uh, merchants being more open to accepting more form factors, consumers looking for credit. And I think there's a stark difference that you called out between the pre-COVID and the post-COVID uh, consumer, uh, what do you say, trends. Sir, Sandeep ji, question yeah, yeah. to you. Yeah. What do you see as large consumer trends now? What, what do you think customers want? And how do you think you know, this current proposition that we're launching today would help or add value to the consumers? Yeah, thank you. Very right question. You know, the, the, yes, see the transition. I'll say that there are two you know, breakers you know, uh, which happened in the industry of you know, digital payment. One was uh, you know, in 2016 when we had this demonetization. And uh, second was the COVID, you know. Uh, you won't believe that uh, after our digitization, we went on the digitization on a multifold. We went from, you know, 6% to say 20, 22% and all that in a span of just few days, few months only. That was one big booster was there. And then subsequently when COVID came, then all this digital payment, you know, people were, you know, not using the hard cash and all that. And then again, there was movement, you know. And as far as this industry is concerned, you know, we, it's a transition in terms of, you know, we had uh, earlier magnetic strip cards and chip cards and then the various form factors have come now and all that. And now coming the uh, blockchain and the cryptocurrency, which are more secured ways and, you know, more economic ways as, as such. And with the lot of uh, intelligence now built into this, artificial intelligence built into this, and it is getting, you know, uh, um, through the learning process, it is getting day by day, you know, it is getting better. And uh, for that matter, I'll say that India is a country where the two-factor or three-factor authentications which are there is really helping people and giving a comfort to the people, giving confidence to the people, you know. And uh, now, uh, as far as now customer require, they require a kind of, uh, at our retail outlets, at our gas station or petrol pumps, so I'll say that they want immediate service like tap and go, rupee, the card now we are going to have it. Uh, rupee pay immediately, pay and go, pay and go. Just tapping it and going. That is where you know it's the transition has taken place, and this is further improvement. And uh, the situation is very dynamic in, for that matter. That once you know one form factor is there, another will come, another will come, and this is an ongoing process. And Indian oil, uh, Indian oil, we are very conscious and very we are concerned that we should be you know uh, the latest in that. We should provide all the facilities what the customer wants before even he starts thinking on that. So that is how we see that the digital and the card business is going to take place. Thank you, sir. I think it, it, it's a market is delight to hear that consumers are actually chasing technology. You know, they are adopting, uh, asking for more technology, more convenience. So I think that's that's great to hear. Uh, Plus the, I'll, I'll, that the watches and all that now which we are coming, yeah, yeah. the wear devices and all that. It's just you know no need of you know uh, going for the pin and all that up to five thousand rupees. It's the pennies, it's not. It just put the watch and go. That is where, you know, it is going to be wonder. wonder that, that, that's a great time to be. I think I, think I remember some, uh, some years back, I think as marketers, we used to chase consumers, adopt this, this is new. And consumers used to ask, what's for me? Today, it's the other way around. Consumers are asking for convenience. They're, they're adopting technology faster. Uh, Pramina, coming to you, I think you've seen the market, uh, not just in India, also uh, some foreign markets. What, what's your sense on the credit card market? How, how do you, when you visualize the next three years or five years, what do you see? Yeah, so when we look at the market in India, you know, our credit card penetration is still very low compared to a number of uh, developed and certainly even the more advanced developing markets. So there is a lot more opportunity present to grow this market. 
And that's what we've been seeing, as Sanjeev pointed out, the pandemic has been a big trigger. So not only has been a, it been a trigger for digital payments, it has also been a big trigger for consumption of credit. And these two put together, you know, have created a very dynamic, fast-growing environment here. And there are so many things that are uh, changing and uh, in flux. So on one side, you have the consumer getting more and more open to adoption of technology and whatever that offers. On the other hand, we also have a lot of, you know, regulatory framework uh, getting established that provides greater level of security for the consumer even as these options are opening up. So it gives uh, the industry a lot more confidence, it gives the consumer a lot more confidence. You know, India, for example, is one of the few countries uh, with a mandatory second factor authentication. So uh, as a country, when we want to go deeper, when we want to bring in more consumers, uh, these are consumers who may not be so aware. So protecting the consumer and creating that very secure framework is so important. And we are seeing that repeatedly now happen. I think, you know, um, RBI has required uh, tokenization when it comes to uh, cards which are used for e-commerce. Uh, at the same time, they've created this relaxation of 5,000 rupees so that the second factor is not required. So for lower value transactions, you can just do a tap and go. So convenience on one side, security on the other. And as far as we have this going right, um, I think we can keep creating... Uh, the opportunities for use and uh, the kind of experiences that will make consumers to to adopt this. Uh, so credit card is going to be driven through, of course, the typical physical you know form factor of the use of a card. And there it's very interesting because we you know we keep talking about this. You know today yes it, you can have a tap and go, but till the merchant stops taking the card from the consumer's hand, uh, the tap and go may not happen. You know the consumer has to give the card then the you know the a uh, person at the counter or at the uh, bank is uh, then may or may not be aware of the full tap and go functionality. So uh, that transition will happen where the, the machine is shown rather than the card being taken and that itself will, will drive uh, some elements. So behavioral changes will also be driven here. Uh, E-commerce of course with you know uh, moving towards uh, single factor authentication with the tokenization. So all of these will be key drivers uh, in the next uh, few years. We will see this momentum continue. Uh, Sanjeev, coming back to you, uh, I think, yes, consumers are looking at new technologies. Consumers are asking for credit. Uh, when you look at the next uh, another 12 months to 24 months, and I think if you had an option to change a few elements of how the industry really gets configured, whether it's on the technology side or the feature side of it, what would you want to change? First thing I want to change is we are number four. We would like we, to be we, number we one. We're taking cues from what you're telling us. Sorry? We're going to be taking cues from what you're going to be telling us. Yeah. yeah. So we are number four. We want to be number one. But anyway, let's leave that aside. Let's leave that competitive element out. Uh, in terms of, see, what's going to change is uh, if today you were to look at variables, I think a couple of things happened. So we started off with variables. Many of these variables actually came from China. Okay. Uh, and for us, it was on a network which is not allowed to issue anything right now. So my sense is as we actually go to rupee variables and all that, we can again propagate it. It's actually a very, one, cool way. Two, it actually, uh, see, you, today payment is like a duty. I bought something so I want to pay, but can I make it fun? Hmm. Uh, what Apple did overall many years back, uh, which is just to make mobile a cool instrument rather than an instrument that you used to talk. Phones used to be so boring long back, right? Those kind of... Today's phone is unrecognizable from the phones then. So can payments become cool? That's one. Uh, if you were to ask me next two years, I don't think it will become 30 percentage of payments. But frankly, if you would, were to even become 3 to 5 percentage of all payments by transaction count, leave the value right now, I think that's a significant advance because it's only the initial mass and the next level which takes it up, then it's a one-way trend. So that's one, which is variables. Second one can be, uh, can you use voice for making payments? Today, uh, you authenticate a transaction through OTP. Can you actually authenticate in a way through voice? Today, a lot of phone banking sale closure happens on voice, but no transaction gets consummated through authentication through voice. So that's the second one. Uh, these are, okay, these may not fructify completely in two years, but these are significant new things which may come in and then it may pick up pace from there. The third one is on the merchant side of it, and I always want to keep talking balance between issuing and acquiring. On the merchant side of it, 
can you actually start entering pin on glass right uh, instead of on an edc where so on so forth etc i think these are two three things which may be nascent trends let's say year from now hopefully initial startup kind of 3 to 5 percentage trend over next couple of years and from there onwards we'll see how people pick it up how people respond to it and what are the trends on what pravina keep uh, keeps alluding to which all of us are very concerned about which is is it safe or not i think if these three points are fine it's definitely cool if it's safe as well then i think it'll pick up from there that's my read and i'm happy to hear uh, yeah if you believe something else can come up here yeah yeah please I think it'll be great too if you want to add to that question. Yeah, yeah definitely. You know, this is uh, the, the kind of you know Sanjeev has shared with you, and then you know, uh, in our case, you know, we are having you know new products which are coming uh, from the petroleum products per se. We are bringing different grades and all that, and that is for the elite segment, you know. And they are the ones, you know, they are taking up it forward, and then you know, XP hundred is our. premium petrol xp95 is our you know this is an extra green is their environment friendly and all that so these are all thing you know and these are all we see that the transaction generally happening through this uh, digital mode of payment only and that's where you know it's going to take up further shape and all yeah yeah if i can just yeah, yeah, uh, add to that so it's a it's a topic very close to my heart right i'm very passionate about the on the go on the go series yeah and i totally agree with sanjeev that it's not going to be the sort of predominant form overnight but i think it it'll bring some fun into into the card uh, world and um, i think we are now seeing a good trend of you know these uh, cards actually getting uh, made in india which is you know promises a local supply at a good robust sort of quality and if we can make it cool with great experiences and i've experienced this in in hong kong and i just used to love it the octopus cards you can use it for retail use it for metro um you know i used to carry one in the shape of a heart that a friend of mine gave me and you know you'll find all kinds of uh things uh, that are there so it's a great gift uh people will keep one in the car you know one in your keychain uh, one in the bag uh, one in the wallet so you know as long as you have Uh, some smaller lines or sort of smaller value on it then the the utility of this becomes very very convenient uh, and a lot of fun which also brings me to the connection on the transit kind of uh, programs of which of course access is a big part and uh, the iocl card itself you know while it's for fuel it does connect back to the larger story of of transit because you know the best buses in fact uh, went live with interoperable uh, you know rupee and cmc cards being accepted uh, we are expecting the mumbai metro to go live so actually mumbai may be the first city to have a full fledged uh, interoperable experience playing out there so that again is very exciting it's it's been a long haul it will still take some time because infrastructure change in india is not going to be fast but i think at the end of this journey we are going to see all of these kind of applications also become drivers to this growth thanks thanks for the great response on that from variables to voice to i think uh, value added products to i think uh, form factors and i think that that's uh, that's lots to actually handle for both consumers and even practitioners like us so i think the next question sandeep ji for you yeah. i think uh, when you look at this current context of today and i think uh, the reason that we all here are for i think what do you think are the value adds or the benefits that the consumers will derive of the product that we are launching today and how do you see consumers accepting that product and you know extracting value what what's the what's the benefit that uh, indian oil drives would would want to drive out of it yeah you know the uh, the thing is that the customer gets you know 4% cash back this is a huge amount which is going to he is get in the first month of the when he gets a road he gets some uh, 250 rupees cash back is there then the best part is that ak you listening right and the best part is that uh, the 1% this the charges which are there up to some 5000 rupees the 1% charges which are there on the credit card they are also going to be exempted and over and above this the book my show this 10% uh, is their uh, benefit is there on this uh, co branded card and then 1% on the overall sales so overall for for them finding that customer will definitely you know go in for this rupee card definitely because it is it is the one which is giving uh, one in the uh, i'll say best in the industry not if it's among the best in the industry whatsoever the facilities which ultimately customer do and then access bank is you know that card is 
well accepted already we have this master's visa so then uh, it's it's endless now the, uh, the the benefits are endless for this card thanks thanks for t touching on that point sandeep ji in, in fact i think that draws me to pravina to the next question uh, i think you might have to open your red book and give us some secrets of that uh, strategy i think rupee possibly had a very humble beginning with debit uh, with credit i think uh, i would say we really become a strong challenger to the biggies of this space what what's your sense on the rupee strategy and how would we really go about you know getting the rightful share of the market yeah so i think that's a that's a nice word what is the rightful share of the market you know Sanjeev was being very humble. He only wants to be number one. Um, so let me say that uh, we we all want to be number one, right? You would agree with that too. <laughs> so we have uh, already number one, and then we have two people on the on the sides who want to be number one. So um, I think you know while we are a card scheme for India, you know unlike other markets like China, example, you know who have taken a very uh, dominating view. of how the local indigenous network will work uh, and many other markets that have kind of closed the borders when it comes to handling domestic transactions in india we are um, competing on equal terms with you know every other uh, card scheme international card scheme that's there in the country and i think that's great because it keeps us on the edge it keeps us uh, competing and it it forces us to become better then players who have been around for a long time and who are very very good at what they do so sort of, uh, very respectful uh, co competition there and i think that's the challenge that we've taken on and we need to get the basics right so which means that um, every issuer in the market uh, the large brands that operate in the market uh, all of them need to be issuing so i think we are we are there in that place so i would say kind of a green tick mark there and then it's about creating the propositions so like this one for example uh the iocl access proposition is a very deadly proposition uh, so as we look at cohorts of uh, consumers um and look at how we need to look uh, you know target uh, some white spaces in the market right not going after the same segment of customers may not be a differentiated strategy because ultimately we want to have a differentiated product with a differentiated strategy so looking at spaces and i think kind of the young professional segment you know we feel very passionately about um i i keep saying that rupee is a 8 year old brand you know it's a very young brand compared to brands uh, like yours which are you know obviously uh, many decades old uh, and of course our competition as well so as a very young brand uh, you know catering to the to the youthful segment uh, being youthful in the way we are positioning the product as well as formulating propositions around the product Uh, all of this is going to be very critical it doesn't mean that it's only for the youth but i think that's kind of where the the proposition needs to to sit and lie and that's really the india of of today and the india of tomorrow and i think all of this basically forms part of that playbook i think uh, sanjeev coming back to you on the topic of youth i think it's also a confusion in my mind and possibly i'm also seeking uh, what do you see insights from you i think the youth possibly is looking for bnpl i think by now pay later I, i don't know in my mind you know is it credit card versus bnpl or is is bnpl going to be the driver of credit cards how do you see it how do you see it shaping the market in the coming years you yeah. see a uh, simple point to understand is india is actually quite uh, large a country and leave the complexity aside for a minute uh, we have 130 to 140 crore people that's like all of europe three times over uh, Economy today is three trillion dollars, uh, which is roughly put it this way, two thousand per capita um, GDP, right? Over the next three to four years, we would expect this to let's say start crossing the five to five trillion dollar. I think is my estimate. One uh, thirty, one forty crore population is not going to grow significantly now. It's going to largely hit one fifty crore in another ten years and going to stay stable at that. So what it means is essentially economy grows, number of population remains the same, so per capita keeps growing from two thousand to three thousand, four thousand, etc. that adds significantly back because what it then means is people who are taking the ticket size of credit cards in india uh, average ticket size the balance sheet all of this changes a lot which also means often times people ask is credit card going to win is upi going to win neither is going to win everything is going to grow similarly in credit card and bnpl there is going to be no one winner bnpl and credit card both can survive at its core by the way credit card is a bnpl it's not a debit card where you buy now pay now you buy now pay later that's the definition of the product and that's why it is such a powerful product 
but it is accepted everywhere because rupay network works everywhere it is not a bnpl integration where i it works on amazon doesn't work on flipkart there is a different bnpl on a platform b platform c etc etc and there is there are very few platforms which are available in offline so beauty about credit card offering is it works everywhere very simple proposition proposition is buy now pay later works for every transaction and it has rewards built on top of it uh, you manage it well you can live 20 years on a credit card without paying any interest at all right uh, it depends upon how the customer manages etc so one view obviously i am more passionate about credit cards than bnpl which is very very obvious second part there is there need not be a winner there doesn't need to be a winner uh, country is deep enough large enough to absorb all of these products okay some will remain at its core payment products let's say upi some will remain at its core bnpl which is credit card there may be new offerings coming in which is equivalent of the bnpl new age bnpls etc which are coming in which is fine they can all coexist us has a i think what some 150 billion dollar balance sheet on cards there are bnpl players there also klarna vrana etc now apple has launched something yesterday that's fine it can all come to india no problem in india the balance sheet for all cards players is less than 20 billion dollars nothing at all right Yeah. Thank you, thank you, Sanjeev. Thank you, Sandeep Ji, and thank you, Praveena. I think thanks. I think for answering all these questions, and I think I give back to you. Ask some really personal ones. Thank you. Thank you. I think you need to give a big round of applause. I, you, it was it was a brilliant discussion. A big round of applause for our panel. And uh, Kunal, thank you for moderating it so beautifully. And uh, it is indeed uh, fueling the future. It's it's a perfect combination. It's a perfect thing which you know caters not just to the youngsters but everybody out there. And we've got we've we've got something for everybody out there. And it's beautifully packaged, sir. Har cheez ko jo mere dimag mein tha, jo har ek ke dimag mein tha, you've kind of covered it so beautifully. And it's not all that we we building on it and we're making it better as times pass by. Let's give a round of applause. Come on, everybody! A fantastic panel. Thank you very much. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you so much. Wow! How are you feeling? Are you feeling good? Hello. You know, I, I sometimes feel that suddenly, na, everybody goes into the shell, saying that, "Yar, ab main kya bolu?" मेरे दिमाग में जितने सवाल थे सारे सवालों को पूरे कर दिए सारे क्वेश्चंस हैव बीन आंसर्ड यू नो आई वाज लाइक 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 एवरी टाइम देयर वाज अ क्वेश्चन व्हिच वाज थ्रोन टू द पैनल आई हैड अ क्वेश्चन इन माय माइंड एंड देन द पैनल सो ब्यूटीफुली कवर्ड एवरीथिंग आई मीन व्हाट एल्स डू यू नीड एंड संजीव साहब ने जो बताया था कि इफ यू हैंडल इट सो ब्यूटीफुली यू कैन एक्चुअली सरवाइव ऑन अ क्रेडिट कार्ड बिलीव मी द डेज आर सच दैट यू प्लान इट वेल and you sorted life is easy and uh, with uh, what uh, ma'am said it's all about doing it the way we have to do it the reach is there the things which we wanted to do is there what all benefits you want four percent cashback plus the benefits oh bhai sahab i mean aur kya chahiye this is the perfect credit card and uh, um Once the launch is done, everybody, please grab it and tell your friends to do that, so that you know everybody gets the benefit out of it. So, so that's how it is. All right, how many of you watched IPL? What was the best part of IPL this year? Oh yes. <laughs> yeah. Anything else? Different opinion, sir? IPL? Did you see? Which was the team at the bottom of the table? Up. Mumbai Indians. It's just that we wanted to give the other teams a chance here. Come on, <laughs> yeah. Is it? Is but you know we've always we won. Any idea how many people know how many times Mumbai Indians has won a IPL? Five, four, five. And this time we just told, "Chalo, yeah, let's understand how it feels to be at the bottom of the table." We just wanted to feel there, you know. Amani sir, I will say, "Yar, get a lot of joy there. You know, chill, do it. You know, it's like that." All right, uh, but you know what? This IPL is really special. I'm going to come to IPL and we're going to talk about, uh, you know, what all happened. But then the most important thing was something which we all loved, and what we loved is coming on the screen right now. I'm not going to talk about that. Just take a look at this. நீங்களும் ரன் படுத்துட்டு வரீங்களா ரெஸ்டாரண்ட்ல கேஷ் கம்மி ஆயிடுச்சு கேஷ் விடுங்க ரூபே யூஸ் பண்ணுங்க ரூபே 
रुपये सर पेमेंट को स्मार्ट आना ईजी आना वरी ईजी जस्ट एप एंड पे उटस्टिंगी understood the ishan sharma ad the language i mean we all understood the ad but tamil therliya any tamilians in the house when i come everybody's okay ma ella sokya nalla irukkeengala all right but, but you know a little bit of tamil is okay but but then guys that is you know the benefits are such that koi appeal is kya humne koi appeal hai nahi so it's like that so just One tap is enough. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, just coming back to IPL. Just a few uh, things. Uh, uh, who won the IPL this time? Gujarat Titans. How many years they've been playing here? Very nice. Just doing a little GK, right? Okay. Any idea? Uh, any 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 um, um, strange thing which happened? Any any strange thing happened in IPL which was related with uh, Harbhajan Singh? Any idea? Sorry, clapping, slapping. I, I, I don't know. Should I clapping? Bola. <laughs> All right, yeah. Anything else? Anybody who scored a double hundred in IPL? Okay. Any any singer who was um, uh, who was a brand ambassador of an IPL franchise? We are Rehman. Four. Yeah, Rehman. Rehman, what's your name? Na? Talented people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Any, uh, yeah. Any idea? Dalair Mehndi, which franchise he played for? Any idea? No. Not CSK. Kings Eleven. Yes. All right. We've got we've got knowledge everywhere. Yeah. Okay. Uh, any idea? Um, which team ka slogan is whistle pod? Very nice. You guys know everything. Yeah. Okay. Finally, one more. Um, Lucknow ki team hai. Any idea who the captain is? K L Rahul, very nice. And K L Rahul is uh, getting married to uh, Trick. Who? All the girls know about it. <laughs> Everybody. All right. Okay. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I have to tell you this: uh, the whole idea of IPL was, you know, what stood out was the rupee ads, and I tr tr trust me, uh, they're good. And it's all about one tap. And believe you me, I am super excited right now. After seeing all this, I'm going to tell all my friends, guys, make life easy. Go for this one. But uh, talking about that, it's time for a little entertainment because we believe in giving you what you want. and we like to mix it with a little bit of entertainment 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 a little hatke please welcome pixel boy with something special take a look at this
Thank you so much. Fantastic. This was brilliant. Wow, that was good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, how many of you are excited for the all new Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee credit card? Uh, okay, let's let's do this applause happening. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready because I am super excited. I'm so thrilled because this is going to make life easy with everybody waiting to grab this one for themselves and their families. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the all new Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee credit card right here. Take a look at this. Here we go. Don't you think it is your time to take charge of your future? With every step towards the future, you bring in your time to shine, your time to elevate, and your time to smile. We bring to you Smile Art Every Mile. Every time you travel, dine out to that classy restaurant, or catch up on that movie, you will have a payment partner who can help you celebrate life and also be easy on your pocket. Introducing to you your payment companion to bring you Smile Art Every Mile credit card designed to benefit you on every transaction. With a special collaboration between the best in the industry, presenting the Indian Oil and Access Bank credit card in association with Rupee, a card that lets you be on the go with a simple tap. Offers welcome benefits. Gives rewards on usage. Gets access to premium lifestyle. Facilitates fee waivers. Lets you enjoy strategic partnership benefits. With so many benefits to indulge in, it's time to experience contactless payments for all your wants in a more rewarding way. So what are you waiting for? Get your Indian Oil Access Bank Rupee credit card today. Wow! You know, I, I, I have everything which I wanted. I had all the things in my heart. Where I have taken care of travel, I have taken care of petrol, I have taken care of book my show. Sir, what do you want to do? And the voice, ka, you know, jo aapne tha, that's, that's the way to, you know, that's, that's the next step. I think you guys are taking care of everything which the common man is thinking about. And believe you me, you're making life so easy for all of us. Thank you, Arab. Thank you very much. Let's give a big round of applause for the legends who've come together to create this. Come on, everybody. Big round of applause. And at this time, I'd request um, the senior dignitaries to kindly come on the stage. May I request uh, uh, Ms. Uh, Parina Rai to kindly come on the stage. Uh, Mr. Sanjeev Moghe Saab uh, and Mr. Sandeep uh, Makar sahab to kindly come for a group photograph. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a big round of applause. Come on, everybody. It's time for a photo of Ladies and gentlemen, special moment indeed. Can we have the senior dignitaries on the stage? Come on, this is the moment we really have been cherishing and we want you on the stage. The teams on the stage as well. Can we have the teams on the stage? Come on. And Talia Bajan Sikta, come on everybody. This is the moment, guys.
Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a round of applause for this one. This is really special, ladies and gentlemen. Fantastic. Let's give it a big round of applause. Come on, everybody. A few more pictures. Very important. It's historic moment. Ko khayet karte. It's nice. Our photographer is a director, you know. <laughs> That's very good, yeah. Thank you so much, thank you so much, thank you so much. Let's give it a big round of applause. Very well done. Thank you. What a moment, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, a big thank you to uh, our distinguished panelists, uh, um, uh, the whole team and the whole crew that's made this happen, users of Access, uh, IOCL's Rupee credit card and... Uh, yes, yes. You know, I, I was just uh, seeing the benefits of uh, fuel waivers, lounge access, um, movie incentives, you'll earn points of spending on several uh, categories. Or catch you I mean, I'm just, just asking, yeah. Anything else? I mean, we pretty much covered everything. Anything else? Top up, okay. Come on, guys. Uh, uh, it's just a suggestion to the guys who've created it. Lounge access covered. Lounge access covered. Uh, let's think more creative, all right? Yeah. Anything else? So, air tickets, IPL tickets. Oh, ma'am, ne bata di. Anything else? Come on, guys. You need to be a little more creative. Anything else you want? Wimbledon. Sir, aap hi kya hath mein sir? You know, you just you just think about it and say, okay, chalo, le lo. Hai, ye bhi hai hamare baad. You know, the way uh, you three were answering the questions, believe you me, we all suddenly hamare sare jis baad jag gaye. You know, we were just thinking that what next? You all have covered so many things that everybody was smiling. And everybody was saying, yeah, ye sari cheezein to hume mil gai hai. Or I, I like ma'am mentioned, you are on par with competition. You're better than that. So you've kind of covered everything. So mota mota, you don't, there's no... No option for anybody else. Silicon option. This is so good. So it's just that you know we just add on to something. So one final one final question. Anybody wants anything else which needs to be integrated? <laughs> Who said that? It's around five o'clock. Shamone me time. Hai. And uh, so you're very creative. Where are you from, sir? From Axis Bank? Thank you so much, sir. Uh, uh, sir, aap hi ke liye shara hai. <laughs> All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go on with the next segment. And this is something really special. I'm, you know, I, I really enjoyed this afternoon because it's, it's been very eventful and uh, it's been very historic because this is something we all have been looking forward for. And uh, uh, the, uh, this, this is something which is very special and very close to my heart. And MPCI is happy to announce that we are signing an MOU with IOCL to promote the use of digital platform, uh, digital payments. And the MOUs highlights, uh, the MOU highlights uh, new programs to develop the cashless ecosystem and make it more convenient for we, the customers. And uh, may I request um, our esteemed guests, Ms. Uh, Praveena Rai, CEO, NPCI, and Sri Sandeep Makar Sahib, uh, Executive Director, Retail Transformation at Indian Oil, to kindly come on the stage and we will have the MOU signing. Ladies and gentlemen, the biggest round of applause right now.
big round of applause. Come on, everybody. The moment we've been waiting for this evening. Fantastic. Whoa, this afternoon has been very eventful, very special indeed. And uh, thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Now, we've got uh, uh, some very special uh, mementos which are going to be presented. And to do the honors, may I request uh, uh, from IUCL, please give a big round of applause, Mr. Sandeep Bakar Sahib, Executive Director of uh, Retail Transformation, Mr. Amitabh Akuri, Executive Director of Retail Sales, and Sri Jagdish Gupta, Executive Director of Finance. Kindly, may I request you gentlemen to kindly come on the stage, please? Okay, so let's get started and um, now we've got, uh, so you're going to be presenting the mementos to these uh, names, I'm going to call them one by one on the stage and applause uh, Jari Ranshaya, ladies and gentlemen, please uh, give a big round of applause as we welcome on the stage um, uh, Mr. Sanjeev Mohge, President, um, Head Cards and Payment, please give a big round of applause. This is from Axis Bank. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a big round of applause for Mr. Prashant Sinha, Senior Vice President, Head Products and Rewards. Zola Talia, come on everybody. Mr. Prashant Sinha, give a round of applause. Come on everybody, Senior Vice President, Head Products and Rewards. Next up, Mr. Vineet Bajaj, Executive Vice President, Head Partnerships. Please give a big round of applause to Sukalyan Forsdar, Senior Vice President, Head Information Technology Payments. Mr. Fauzdar, give us a big Come on, everybody. Mr. Nakul Goel, Vice President, Head Business Solutions Group. Nakul Goel, give us a big Come on, everybody. Round of applause. Please give it up for Mr. Deep Sooth, Vice President, Business Solutions Group. Congratulations. Please welcome Ms. Archana Koshik, Deputy Vice President, Head, Cards Marketing. Let the applause keep going. Come on, everybody. A round of applause for Ms. Mittal Solanki, Deputy Vice President, Corporate Communications. It's, let's give a big round of applause, everybody. Ms. Mittal Solanki. A round of applause for Johnson P. Vice President, Head Card Sales. Please give it up for Mr. Amit Bhardwaj, Senior Vice President, Head CRS. Clearing and Reconciliation. And now from M NPCI, please give it up for C our COO, Ms. Praveena Rai. Let's give a big round of applause. Come on, everybody. Please welcome Rajit Pillai, Chief Business. Let's give it up for Mr. Pillai. Come on, everybody.
Please welcome Kunal Kalavatiya, Chief Product. Round of applause for Kunal. Please welcome Mayur Kaku on the stage. Keep the applause going. <laughs> Please welcome Ravi Khan Sharma. Please welcome Jitendra Manik. A round of applause for Abhishek Swarankar. Please welcome Sandesh Kundar. Thank you, gentlemen. Let's give a big round of applause for the presentation party. Thank you so much. Let's give a big round of applause in it. Whoa, what an afternoon this has been. It's been a very eventful afternoon. It's been a very special afternoon. It's been a very empowering afternoon, you know, after which um, uh, we're going to go back with a card and say, Tere paas kya hai? Mere paas ye card hai. So, you know, it's just like that. So, you just go on, flash wherever you want, make life easy. And of course, you can tell your friends saying that, Achha, tere paas wo hai? So it's you know, just a, the conviction and the smile says it all and uh, I've really enjoyed this afternoon. It's been a fantastic afternoon. Let's give a big round of applause for the MOU and the all new powerful Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee Credit Card. Let's give it a big round of applause. Come on everybody. Fantastic. And uh, now for the closing remarks, please welcome uh, Chief Business Development and Marketing uh, NPC. Uh, please give it up for Mr. Rajit Pillai. Come on everybody. Let's give a big round of applause. Okay, hi. Hi, everyone. I hope uh, everyone enjoyed this evening. And uh, like the way we enjoyed presenting the entire thing. So, wholeheartedly thanking uh, everyone who have come here. And congratulations to the entire team. Starting with uh, Mr. Sandeep, uh, Mr. Amita, Mr. Gupta, and your entire uh, team from Indian Oil. Mr. Sanjeev Moge, our friends, Prashant and Vineet Bajaj, Karthik Gupta, and the entire Access Bank team who have come here. My colleagues, uh, starting from Praveena Rai and Kural, and my entire team from NPCI. We at NPCI, we are very you know, excited about this new card. Primarily because of three things. Number one, we started you know, uh, chasing Access Bank to get into this credit card deal since a long time. And finally, this day has come. India is one of the leading private banks joining Rupay as, uh, you know, uh, the path of Rupay. And we are very excited about that. Number two, we have got m more steps and more inroads uh, in partnership, uh, strategic partnership with Indian Oil. That's again a big, uh, you know, wow factor for us. And lastly, we are excited about this entire card in terms of the opportunity that it has for all of us. Because this card, like I was telling Mr. Sandeep earlier, has immense, immense opportunity. Because this is one product that every person in this entire country, I think not every person, probably most of the people will use it in the same form factor. Unlike any other product or commodity that you can ever think of. 
So the scope becomes immensely large. So if we take out of you know one person out of the 1.4 billion people that we have in this country, we are looking at a whopping 14 million cards in case we run for it. I'm sure Prashant and Vinit will at least look into half of that at least and uh, probably work out in the next five years and chase for it. With that, I would like to conclude my uh, speech. Thank you all for coming over. Over to AK uh, Rehman. Thank you for entertaining us. One more thing. I thank Zeba. Let's have a one big round of applause for Zeba for organizing this entire event. Thank you, Zeba. Thank you so much. Uh, very nicely concluded. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, that's it. Yeah. The evening has come to an end. But then, Shama uh, Jawane, thank you, Zeva. You've done a fantastic job. Zeva was the one who briefed me uh, completely uh, with the team of DDB Mudra. Thank you, guys. You guys are amazing. Okay, uh, guys, um, uh, that's that's all for the evening. Uh, join us for drinks. Drinks, eh? Kya? Aise puch uh, nahi hai na? Achha, well, let's have a chai pe charcha. So, guys, thank you so much. It's been a great evening. Uh, it was an honor for me to join you guys. And, uh, um, you know, you guys have been very inspiring. And thank you so much for giving India the card which we all needed. So, make sure that, you know, you are the ones who are going to spread this to every part of the country. And make sure that you empower every Indian with the Indian Oil Axis Bank Rupee Credit Card. Till next time, AK Rahman signing off saying, have a great evening, guys. Thank you so much for joining in.